Hey everyone, welcome back to our Pokemon Ultra Sun Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we did the trainer school and caught ourselves a Mega Pidgeot from the trainer school. And in this episode, we're going to Holy City. Because that's the next step of where we need to go. So also cool in this generation is the Rotom Dex gives you like a little arrow to this and you know where you need to go. With the Holy City. I think we've got, an we've got at least one encounter in Holy City. So we can get to a team of five. We've got a water type, we've got a grass type, we've got a not we've got a flying type. So like some of it covers the weaknesses. Fight like fire or like electric could be kind of cool. But as long as it's not something terrible. <laughs> Cause we're at the beach front. Oh, uh, yeah, you just said that. So he goes, "Oh, hey, you come, you, 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 you're here from very far away, aren't you? Very friendly." Hello, Aloha. We don't have a fishing rod yet, so we can't get. We can't get we can't get a fishing running counter. Pretty certain this guy wants us to do something. Oh, I just I just have. As you can sprint in over. Big idea or something to do. Such a gift of the Russian decks. Puppy Finder. I can't remember what the Puppy Finder does. Oh, it's a it's a bird plating machine. Okay, we 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 got to do the buggy fan a little bit. Oh, yeah, lovely. You guys want to do can take pictures. Yay! But there's a picture thing. Whether we have to do it or not, I don't know. How it instantly thinks about your stomach. Well, when you were in our dollar, you could do it. You always need to have some food. Yeah. Figured we'd need to. Figured we'd, we'd probably need to do this this bit. So there's, there's quite a few tutorials. It's a tutorial section. Big dude just stood there. Just take all, just take all, just take all six. Just take all six and just, and just stay in the boat. The one where he's looking off to the side, like, why is this guy taking pictures of me? Why is this trainer taking pictures of me? 
<laughs> uh, the thumbs up. Yay. Oh, we can close it, we can close it. That was random. Now we've done this tutorial. And maybe that. I think we'll just go into here and grab our own thing, so. The Hawaii Shopping Center. Shop, shopping, shopping District. So there's quite a few encounter routes. Ooh, Arbok. Interesting. Um, poison. Should just be able to catch him. Six, we're six levels higher. If not, I will just thunder wave it. Probably gonna thunder wave it because it should just be primarily poison, so it shouldn't be able to. Shouldn't have any ground moves. Probably will be. It probably its only move will probably be like wrap. I think. I'm trying to think. It might, it might have like poison gas or something. It's only using Leer at the moment though. It's good having a status Pokemon. Especially in a hardcore Nuzlocke, which means that... Mm -hmm. oh. So close. I had... by... But that did not... that did well damage. I probably should have switched to Kyogre just so it just so gets a crit and doesn't kill me. Really? There we go. Doesn't matter. We got it. That's an error box. Yeah, it's just primary poison. Yes, we will name it um, Salazar. Salazar the Apoc. So we can just leave it now. But don't think there's an item in there. Um, see what its ability is. Nice, pure power. That might be why Bite did. Is that why Bite did so much damage? That would, probably, probably is because like, it's pure. Is it pure power special or is pure power both? That means you put a really good artwork. Of course I do. Of course I put my own clothes. Most people don't. <laughs> it's in clothing. It's, oh, it's a lens case. Cool. What I always wanted. <laughs> what I always wanted was a lens case. Yeah, we obviously don't have to. We obviously don't have to. We obviously don't have to. There's a, there's there's the totem stickers that would be fun to collect. They're being put up by um, Lima. Is this one we fight in? Not so. Um, yes. The totem, the totem, right, the totem stickers that allow you to get totem sized Pokemon. But yeah. Pure Power Arbok. 
Yeah, I'm leveled right now, though. I'm yeah, leveled. It's like, what, half level of the everybody else? It should grow when uh, in, in Vitesman picks up a decent amount of XP to the XP show. Just gonna heal though. We can use, we can heal in the bottom of so that's perfectly fine. We've got kind of two poison types, two water types, one part flying type, and one electric type. We have got some decent type of ridge. We're gonna, we're gonna go down here. I'm not certain when we actually fight that guy. Prison we do. Oh. How he's found a food place. Get Malasada. I'm barely. Just trying to remember something into the thing. Yeah. Make your Pokemon affection towards you. Oh, it's Team Skull. It's Team Skull. What? Oh no, we're not doing that. Okay, there you go. I'm gonna change you to give me a mad skills. Yeah, I doubt that. Some family just dies like that. As long as, as long as it's not a ground type, we should be fine. Literally just said, as long as it's not a ground type, we're fine. Um. I'm just gonna go into my. Oh, I'm gonna use a lot of aggressive move. Uh, I'm gonna go into, I'm gonna go into wings. So we've got a super effective move on Tartaro. This is not looking good. Oh, that's not. That's not fun. Let's see, do we. We're gonna, we're gonna sand attack it a couple turns. So if we do lose wings, it'll suck, but it won't be as bad as losing like Rose on run um, or I don't think withdraw can miss because it's uh, its own move. But I do think if we just sand attack it like four or five times, we goes to when it actually goes to a when it goes to attack, its accuracy will be lower and it will be very Higher chance in our favour. I'm, I'm trying to I'm just trying to destroy his accuracy. As long as it is, we can't heal. Okay. I think we should be fine. Curse and Gust is special anyway. So we should be fine. Oh yeah, we're more than fine. Because um, Gust is special, so it takes its special against its special defense, not its raised actual natural defense. Actual natural. Should be a win. Because even if it had sturdy, we we did we two hit with it, so it doesn't matter. Win level eleven to wings. Gain some more speed. Gains two levels from that fight. Should only gain two. Tumble game. Tumble Fall gonna go a little bit over level for this next fight. Well, I don't know, I think it might all be like level 13. Sazar's gonna gain a few levels. No, oh, Sazar only gonna one. Probably it's Gleevold. He probably takes more XP. 
Not fair, I was playing a different game. Who even wants them anyway? Judge and that's all cool. Who even wants them? Who wants them anyway? We're just playing. We're playing game. Seems to fresh my gas suit. Oh, thanks. But this is this one we fight Lingma? Okay, well, we, we see we we're fully healed, so. Okay, this is the cat's name vote. So we have actually perfectly leveled the level cap. We have at the peak of level 13. So that's something with Needle King. That kind of sucks. Okay, I don't want any grass moves, so. Smartest and safest switching is to Ocean. Because Rosam has no water moves, and also I can't paralyze it with Thunder Wave because it's part of ground. It's ground poison, or poison ground. Breaking them up, it uses double kick. This is gonna hurt at all. I'm sick, oh, so it was a crit. Are both gonna be a crit? No, just four, four, four naturally. We should. We should be faster, and one water pulse should do some decent damage. We are faster, water pulse should reasonably maybe one hit. It's not strongest water move, but it is coming from a primal Kyogre. Sounds like we're in another level, which is good. You know, two levels. Captain back up, and Lima has a shot up. Chat, chat up, chat, chat up. Um, we'll switch back to tumble, flying type, thunder shock. I'm in normal, might, might be normal flying, but we should be fine. This tumbles, and tumbles just on the edge of going over on wood. Yeah, faster thunder shock should one hit. Oh, it doesn't. He uses Taunt. Oh, it felt... He fell for it, which means you can't use the same twice, which means I'm just gonna have to... Wait, wait. Why, why, why not me use... Wait, what? Are you Thunder Shot? I don't get it. Sure, sure, I should be able to use Thunder Shot. Fawn for the Taunt means you can't use the same move twice in a row, right? Oh, if you're under Taunt, you can't use the state status move. Don't know. There we go. We're just a level, but at the right time. No, I'll go around level 14. Obviously, it wasn't the most difficult of fights. Yeah, that's what we'll be heading to next. A Bidget and a Lola. So wait, what are Lola and Tally? I think we're just gonna run back and we're just gonna run back and heal. That'll be probably where we end to the episode. Unless there's any more dialogue further up here. There isn't. Gonna heal. So we've got a pure power Arbok. And we beat Lima and the teams all around level 14. So it's like it's like five levels beneath where it needs to be, but it will gain that. Because low level it will catch up with the XP show. At least now they're being that fight the XP the, the level cap can go, so we're not we don't we don't have to just use that move itself. 
that plug myself. So that'd be close where we end today's episode. So thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. Until next time, see ya!